we are given the quadratic equation x minus a times x minus b is equal to c. This can be written as x square minus in brackets a plus b times x plus a b minus c is equal to 0. Now we are given that alpha and beta are the roots of this equation. Therefore, the sum of the roots alpha plus beta is equal to a plus b and the product of the roots alpha beta is equal to a b minus c. Let's call this result 1. Now we need to find the roots of the equation x minus alpha times x minus beta plus c is equal to 0. This can be written as x square minus in brackets alpha plus beta times x plus alpha beta plus c is equal to 0. Now from result 1 we know that alpha plus beta is equal to a plus b and alpha beta is equal to a b minus c. Therefore this quadratic equation can be written as x square minus in brackets a plus b times x plus a b minus c plus c is equal to 0. This simplifies to x square minus in brackets a plus b times x plus a b is equal to 0. Which implies that x minus a times x minus b is equal to 0. And therefore the roots of this quadratic equation are x is equal to a and x is equal to b. Therefore to summarize x is equal to a and x is equal to b are roots of the quadratic equation x minus alpha times x minus beta plus c is equal to 0. And this is the required answer.